Um, our eighth grade students in Mr. Gall's class are actually working on a digital uh, presentation over the Civil War. What we've done is the students have actually drawn a topic and um, been given an outline of different questions that they need to answer where they have to use more synthesizing skills, more higher level thinking of how would things be different today if they did not, um, this didn't happen during the Civil War, or if this different battle didn't occur, or if the outcome was different than what it was. We this year have already done uh, Movie Maker, so that's one of their options that they can do. Um, we used Powtoons, which um, the kids really enjoyed that, and that's one of their options. Um, they can all, they can do storyboard that, where they create a storyboard, kind of like a comic strip. Um, they can make an infograph, or they can do Toondo, which is also another option that's similar to um, Powtoons. Or they can do a combination of them and put them all together. So it really allows them to take what they've learned and um, put it together in a format that's comfortable for them, but also making sure that they hit those essential questions that are on the sheet and be able to fully explain what their topic is. I like Movie Maker because the software allows you to do transitions in different like effects with your text. You can have it inserted a different way. I like using the technology because it's more interactive and I feel like I learn more when I'm doing hands-on stuff. What we've seen so far this year, we've done one um, all quarters except the first one, so this is our third project, is that um, the engagement is nearly 100%. You know, these kids are, every day they're immersed in technology, that's their world, that's their life. And to take them out of that in, in school and just have them use books and paper all day long really is difficult for some kids. So when you really start to immerse the technology back in and integrate it back into the curriculum and giving them the options of presenting what they know and showing what they know in different ways, um, you see that they're a lot more engaged and um, they're a lot more willing to present. They want to show you, they want to do their work. It doesn't seem necessarily like homework or an assignment to them.